I'm here with Alan Burnett, a producer on Batman, the animated series. Um, there's something really special about this show that it's kind of stood the test of time. Why do you think that is? I, you know, I don't know. They said in TV Guide it was the second most, I forget how, the, the second favorite animated series ever, right after The uh, uh, Simpsons. And uh, that surprised me. I, I get taken aback by how much how popular it's been. So, and it's hard to believe that you know twenty, what twenty six, twenty seven years later, yeah. I'm standing here talking to you about this show. Yeah, yeah. Over the course of the series, were there any moments in particular that were particularly meaningful for you, whether they be on screen or off screen? Well, I just it, every week we'd have somebody. Uh, in the studio, some actor in the studio, who I loved watching when I was a kid, yeah. and uh, so there were a lot of '50s and '60s stars that came back for the show, which I uh, I liked. I'm a big Hitchcock fan. We had three, we had three Hitchcock actors: uh, John Vernon and Tippi Hedren and Roscoe Lee Brown. I mean, stuff like that. Uh, you know, uh, it's it's important to to me. So yeah. Uh, but uh, it's just it was just a great experience, and uh, we never tired of the show. When we when we were done with it, we went on to other stuff. But I would go back to a show like this again anytime. Yeah. You know, it was fun. Is there anything that you, if you could go back to the show? Is there anything that you didn't get a chance to do that you'd love to, like maybe a particular character to bring in or a certain story you wanted to tell? Boy, we really made an attempt to cover all the, all the supervillains. Yeah. We really did. Uh, Bruce Tim one time said, eh, we should have come up with our own in some cases. And I said, yeah, but I wanted to cover those. And we did come up with our own. We did Batman Beyond. So, uh, But it was a... Uh, it's hard. I, I have no regrets about anything that happened in the show. It, you know, it was a good show. It was a lot of hard work, a lot of good people. And, um, and, and the fun thing about it today for me was I, uh, did, I was producer on a show called Justice League Action. Sure. It was uh, a half-hour show for, for – it had comedy in it, a lot of comedy. Uh, and it was about the Justice League. And uh, I met – half a dozen to a dozen writers uh, on that show who wanted to write for that show, who were writing for prime time in, in many cases, who just wanted to do a Justice League a a cartoon show because of Batman, because that's what they, after school was over, that's what they ran home to see. So I, 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 I finally, in my last years or, or so there, I, in, in uh, Hanna Barbera, not Hanna, I mean Warner Brothers, uh, I finally, uh, uh, I finally saw that. I saw the influence on other artists, which was great. Great. Well, as part of that group that ran home to watch the show, thank you so much oh, for being a part you. of it. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you very much.